This is WCPO 9 News. Thanks for joining us for WCPO 9 News. I'm Kristen Swilly. Here's a look at some of today's top stories. A man is dead after a crash in Mount Airy. It happened just after 10 o'clock last night on Coleraine Avenue. Police say Douglas Brooks was heading north when he lost control of his car. According to investigators, his car crossed the center line and hit a Ford Fusion. Brooks was taken to UC Medical Center where he died. Two people in the Ford Fusion were treated at the scene. Investigators say excessive speed appears to be a factor in the crash. A homicide investigation is underway after a person was shot and killed in Millvale. Police found the suspect on Beekman Street near Moosewood around 530 yesterday afternoon. The victim is a man. Police say they will release more information soon. Five people are injured, one critically from an apartment fire in Anderson Township. Emergency crews say the fire started in the apartment basement. They got inside and managed to evacuate everyone. Firefighters had to pull someone from the basement window. That person is in the hospital in serious condition. Everyone in the apartment had to be displaced. The Red Cross now helping them find shelter. Happening today, the Bearcats will put their 28 game home winning streak on the line versus the Hoosiers. The Bearcats are back at Nippert Stadium to host Indiana at 3.30 p.m. This season, Indiana comes in with a 3-0 record. The game is sold out and the Bearcats are coming off a 38-17 victory over rival Miami. Today's game also marks the first Big Ten opponent to come to Cincinnati since Purdue in 2013. Raven? All right, so that game should stay on the dry side. We'll see partly to mostly cloudy skies, kind of clearing tonight, and then Sunday we do have another chance to see some rain moving in, mostly for the afternoon, and a lot of this will be on the isolated side, so some of us may not see any rain at all. Highs for today will make it to the mid-70s for most of us. 74 degrees for Cincinnati. The rest of your forecast will also be into the 70s for your Sunday and much cooler looking ahead to next week.